London is an enormous city and it's a great, great cultural capital. And I want to encourage people, you, into the love of art. I want you to become an art lover. Or if you already are, I want to encourage you in the pursuit of art. Because thinking and understand it, because it helps you to understand the world you live in, get a life. My duty, my aim in life is to understand the world I live in. We only have a little tiny chance to do that and we might as well take advantage of it, know who we are, understand the world we live in. If people would do that, the world would be a different place. We suffer incredibly from a lack of culture. Now then, when I talk about culture, I'm not talking about popular culture. Popular culture is just running round, sucking things up, reading magazines, just letting things just come in. It's just a total passive thing to do. You don't get a life from that. You're a cipher in a world of consumerism in that case. And get a life means you get out what you put in. You have to care a lot, you have to get very, very involved to look at paintings, which is what I do. And of course I go to music concerts and I'm talking about high culture and it's that which holds society together for good because culture is something that humanizes people. It makes you understand the human genius, who you are, what human beings can do, what amazing things human beings have been capable of. Now then, there is a problem here. I put it this way. I, if I would be a teacher, which I once was, I would always teach something from a perspective. How do you see the world? 10 years ago, how did people see the world? How did my mother see the world? How did they see the world in the time of the Renaissance? You always need to know this because every age must somehow reinvent its past by looking at it from the standpoint that we are today. Of course, you always try to understand the mind of the people, what they were looking at, but by doing that, you also see it from your point of advantage in time. It's not a point of advantage, it's just you're further down the road, things have happened between. 